Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. Hopefully you're having a lovely weekend. Um, if you're here in Ontario, you're probably getting hit with snow and ice and water and rain, I don't know, all that stuff. Anyway, um, it is the day before our Epic Life Challenge starts, which is tomorrow. Um, so <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to get started, but you know, I meal prep anyways, every couple of days I set stuff up. Um, so, um, it's Sunday and I'm getting set up. So first things first, um, dehydrated, defrosted chicken overnight. Um, this is kind of what we do. We buy, um, large quantities at, uh, like Costco or Eddie's or whatever of different forms of protein. Um, this one is our chicken thighs. And I'm going to do um, lemon garlic chicken. And what this is for is actually for is from lunches and things for the week. So for the next couple of days, um, we're going to uh, have some lemon garlic chicken. It says oil, but yeah. Just roll it around in there so everything gets coated in the seasonings. You could put a bit of water in, that's a good thing because then it's like you got a bit of broth with it. But most of the chicken is taking up the seasonings anyways. It's for like a whole pound of chicken. Hey hope. So it's good. Anyway, that's that. Um, microwave, we will start. I will do 10 minutes, just probably give it a stir, and then probably another 10 minutes, um, and then that's that. Okay, so that's one meat using our lemon garlic chicken. Um, that is for, for the week. Then I have some ribs here, which I'm gonna marinate or dry rub in essence. So I'm using our barbecue chicken and rib, which is not available anymore in the uh, catalog. It will be come April, because it is a standard for us, but we always make sure we have we're stocked up because it's, it's a standard for us, personally. We use it all the time. And um, Victor wanted a little a Louisiana. So put a little bit of Louisiana in there. I'm just making sure that most of it's covered. Um, and there we go. So that's set for this afternoon. Um, to make and what we're going to actually make with it. And the reason why we're having the ribs is because uh, in the Epic Box, there was a taste test. So this isn't in the catalog. It's creamy polenta. And looking at different recipes to have a polenta was like barbecued ribs. So that's what we're going to have. So this literally takes 15 minutes in the microwave or so. Um, so I'm not going to make it right now. Good morning. I'm going to make it when we're doing the ribs so it's fresh. And then when I'm making it, I'll totally take videos and pictures, of course, you know, and show you what it looks like. But literally in a round steamer, which I've got all set up and ready to go, um, put the mix in two cups of water and one cup of milk. So I'm going to use um, oat milk, but you can use whatever. Microwave covered on high for five minutes. Remove from microwave. Whisk well to break up any lumps and stuff. Um, then you whisk in another cup of milk of some sort and a tablespoon of butter. Microwave uncovered at high for 10 minutes, whisking halfway through, and then let it stand and then whisk while you're baking. So it's just a little bit of like steps going through, but nothing complicated. It's just stop, stir, stop, stir, stop, stir. So that's it. And then here, cornmeal, um, Parmesan cheese. So it does have dairy in it, but it's polenta. So, you know. Uh, milk solids, whey, salt, yeah, a little bit of salt. Yeah, there's not really that much in here, so there you go. Anyway, that will be this afternoon, and I will share that. Um, and that's the ribs, so that's what goes with there. Um, and then those are that. So then, of course, next I wanted to do was make my own um, breakfast bites or snack bites, or whatever you want to call it. So, it's two cups of our salted caramel protein or any, good morning, Emery, um, or any protein you want, or um, if you want, you could use vanilla protein with our caramel pudding. 
Um, that's pretty much where this recipe comes from. I just uh, adjusted it. Um, a half a cup of whatever kind of butter you want, nut butter, seed butter, peanut butter. Um, we're using peanut butter crunchy because that's what we got. Use what you have. Yeah. Um, and then a quarter cup of maple syrup or honey or something and two tablespoons of melted coconut oil. That's in here. I have honey. Um, I need to use it up. So it's all been warmed up. Give it a quick stir. Okay. Um, two tablespoons of flaxseed or, or anything. This is just me. You don't have to do this. Um, but I'm out of that, so using it all up. Um, I also will put in a bit of turmeric. You can put greens powder, um, whatever you particularly want. And I'll go the orange. Um, if you just want to amp it up a little bit, greens powder is good. It's actually pretty fun to roll it in greens powder too. Um, that's a good one. And then with a little bit of cocoa and greens powder and you don't taste the greens powder. <laughs> and then about, I think it's about a cup of oats or hemp hearts, um, whatever it is you want. The recipes online say hemp hearts. Again, I go with what I have. And that's what's easy for me because these are something I'll grab or make just randomly because I'm out of things for breakfast or a snack or something. Um, so that's kind of how I do it. But it is what you want to do with it. Okay. That's it. Boom. Boom. All right. So... Then I take coconut, or you can take whatever you want, nuts, as I said, cocoa powder, um, greens powder, whatever. Um, just make sure you do it right away while it's still sticky. Um, and then let them set up in the fridge, and then you have uh, protein bites. As I said, you could use any of our sweet mixes if you wanted, and that'll give you your your flavor profile, you just use a little bit, a couple of tablespoons of it or something to add to it. And then put the protein powder, oh, wow, sorry, uh, chocolate or vanilla or caramel or whatever you want. So there we go. So that's it. That's my simple bit of meal prep I'm going to do this morning. Um, and yeah, so there we go. So Epic Life Challenge starts uh, tomorrow. In essence, you know, you can get going on it now. Um, the collection um, is still on sale um, for another couple more days till the 18th, like nine o'clock uh, Pacific time, but personally it's the 17th. <laughs> so you still have a couple days to grab that if you wanted to. And the reason why I kind of say grab it is because if you are needing to stock up on some items um, like protein powder, for example, this is in um, the salted caramel is in that collection along with the lemon dilly, Greek salad dressing, apple pie spice, and then five, um, five, I don't remember now, I think it's five of the uh, meal solution packages. So it gets you started. So like donair seasoning, mac and cheese, sweet and sour, uh, stir fry, just gets you a good starter kit if you're looking to just get going. And then it comes with an e-guide so that um, you can just pull it up. Um, and find a recipe or a meal plan or an idea. It has a lot of build your own pages, like build your own soups, build your own dinners, build your own salads, build your own uh, smoothies. So um, you can go ahead and adjust it based on whatever your uh, flavor profile is or diet restrictions are, whatever it might be. Um, and that's one of the things I love is those build your own. Um, yeah, and then you will be having the opportunity to vote and be a part of our um, app that's coming. So we do have a Epic Life app coming. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna do the test run in February, and everyone who's part of this uh, collections and bought the membership. Basically, you buy the membership. You buy the membership. You get into the uh, voting and making decisions on what we're going to see in the app, um, test running, beta running it, whatever. 
and then it goes live in April. And then in April, uh, that's when your membership actually starts. So you get it from April to April kind of idea and you get to try it out and actually use it. So which is pretty cool. So I'm excited for that. So we have a lot of our recipes in there, our meal plans. It'll have a, a lot of like what's in the e-guide, but in an app. So you can just say, well, I'm having this today. I'm having that today. Um, and then it'll help you have a good, um, like a food diary all set up for you, which is what I'm excited for. I'm not really, uh, it's a food diary thing for me, for my health, for my information and migraines and things. Um, when things are not feeling so great, sometimes it's just good to be able to see, well, what did I eat yesterday and how did it affect me? Um, and so that's what I like. And then if it's on an app, I'm an app person. If I can do everything on my phone, I will. <laughs> so I'm really excited for that because then I don't have to go somewhere else or find the paper or did I bring the paper with me when I travel, you know, all that. So anyway, that's me. That's what I'm looking forward to. As you well know, I don't look at any of this as it's not about weight. It's not about anything like that. You are who you are and your, your body knows. It's just about all the other stuff. So yeah, so there you go. Made a whole bunch of... Salted caramel coconut protein bites. Now these just go in the fridge and they'll set up and that's what I'll be able to have for breakfast for the next, um, well, over a week. Hey, look, the sun is out and Pax, where'd you go? There she is. And Pax has found it. <laughs> uh, Emery, would you say crushed nuts, candy canes at Christmas? Oh yeah, those are good options. Yep. Anyway, there we go. Uh, the Taste of the Season also is still available, and it's still on sale. Um, so, I don't know, what, 12% off or something, um, which is pretty cool. <clears throat> what else? Yeah, so there we go. The chicken is coming along nicely. And it smells like lemon garlic. All right, so there we go. So that's my lemon garlic chicken. I'm um, just going to pull it apart a little bit, pull it like let it cool down a little bit, pull it apart, finish cooking it, um, and then that'll be for our lunches for the next couple of days. Just lemon garlic chicken pulled apart. So sandwiches, salads, whatever um, you want to do, and that's what that is. The ribs ugh, are in essence marinating with uh, barbecue chicken and our Louisiana. Um, as I stated that what's going with that will be polenta, which is the taste test that we got in our Epic Life box, or Epic Life, or Epic Box, sorry, Epic Life is a lot of talk. And then, of course, I made um, my version of the protein bites. Um, so there you go. That's my quick meal prep for today, um, about 10 minutes. And, yeah, so what else? What else can I tell you? Um, I guess thank you so much for everybody who's, um, you know, supported me and been here. Um, I am so close to earning that trip for one. Um, 3,600 points to go. 3,600. Ooh, so close to 50,000 points. Oh my gosh. Anyway, I'm going to do it. It's going to be cool. And yeah, so if by chance you needed to order um, in the next you know month or so, feel free to like hop on and order maybe a little bit sooner. Um, hit me up if you're interested in having your own cooking class. Um, that helps as well. Um, yeah, if you want to do that this month, um, you have the extra $20. If you host in January and you, we close the class in January, you get an extra $20. Um, it's kind of like if you hit the $500 level, you already get 20. It's kind of like, you don't have to do that, but why not? Cause then you get 40, um, which is happening right now. We've got a class that's this close to hitting the 500 level, which is exciting. Um, the mystery host event is still happening all month long. So you order, um, and uh, host um, your name will go in a raffle to win some host benefits that will happen later on so I'll just suggest timing based on if you're a host or if you're a customer when you can have your host mystery items and you know me I'll probably award two people at least for that and what else um, and yeah and you can still uh, jump on and be your own Epicure ambassador or your own savvy consumer with Epicure and come join um, my team um, we're rocking and rolling we're having an awesome time if you want to come join us that would be awesome it also helps me as well earning my points towards the trip um, anyone who joins like this month 
um, and does their two first 250 um, in their first month with this this month and next month, um, it goes the points. I get matching points basically. So you get your points, I get, and I get matching ones. So I don't take anything away from you, but it's a win-win all around. Um, and I can help you out with that. So if you're thinking about, I buy every other month, I love hosting, I want to have this into a biz or anything like that. Um, there's options for all of that. There is, um, there's no monthly fee. There's just the one access fee. Um, and then in a year later on your anniversary, when you join, there is an insurance fee um, and it's less than the access fee. So it's like $29.95 for that insurance fee, but that's a year away. Right now it's just $49.95 to join and you can earn back that $49.95 um, if you do $1,000 within your 90 days. So if you join in January, you have to the end of April, in essence, to do a thousand. And that's pretty easy. If you have an event a month, um, that would take care of it. And you earn back that $49.95. And then there's more you can obviously earn with all the rewards that we got going on. So yeah, so hit me up if you're interested and just to see what it's all about, what it can do for you getting back, getting paid to eat. <laughs> um, and yeah, and don't forget, as I said, the Taste of Season is still on sale. The Epic Life Collection is still on sale. Um, and if you host, you get $20 extra in this month of January. Anyway, thanks for hopping on. If you watch later, hit replay. Otherwise, let me know what you're doing. How are you meal prepping? Are you doing it weekly? Are you doing just your breakfast? Are you doing it every couple of days? Um, are you jumping in? You haven't jumped in yet. You want some help with that? You know, you can reach out. We can have a little chat about how you can get rolling um, with meal prep if that is something you want to make a priority this year. Otherwise, happy Sunday.